The Intermediate Space Challenge, um, we do after star testing, which kind of gives the kids a little reward for doing well on the test. It brings us together as a class, giving us a team unity that then we get to compete together. The kids really seem to enjoy it, and it's a lot of fun. Kids like it. My favorite part of when we had to get ready for the rocket launch was making our banner. We had a lot of fun and we, get to, we got to cut up stars and we got to put our names on them. For the Space Challenge, you have to build a rocket um, and design the rocket. You have to create a banner and you have to submit an essay and you have to submit an illustration to go along with that essay. And all three of those, or all of those things are judged. The Intermediate Space Challenge taught me gravity. Gravity means that more like when you walk and then you put your foot down on the ground. The Intermediate Space Challenge brings an element of science that the kids haven't had before. Um, pro a project building, working together as a group, um, different design ideas, creativity, um, a lot of teamwork goes into it. Um, from t-shirt designs to banner designs to writing essays and picking whose picture will um, be submitted as the class picture or voting on whose picture will be the class picture. Um, lots of compon components of teamwork. The high school students taught me about how to make paper rockets and about gravity. I think um, with the Intermediate Space Challenge, when um, a teacher here at Joshua broke the record for height for his rocket, it kind of stepped the level up for all of the kids and they wanted to make sure that every year it was like, oh, we can beat that record and we're going to beat that record. And so all of the kids got really involved with it being close to home and the kids take an interest in that. Kids start to look forward to it. The elementary kids in third grade come and watch it. It gives them something to look forward to. I'm really looking forward to this station. My favorite part is when they, rock, they launch the rocket. The purpose of the Intermediate Space Challenge is to expose kids to possible career choices in math, engineering, and science. And it's to get them excited about it um, at a young age, uh, and especially for kids that might not be exposed to, to techni you know, technical things like building rockets and, and the math that goes along with it. It's fantastic for children and students. Listen to that.
that enthusiasm. I mean, a rock star couldn't generate that. These kids, they got involved, they're building, they're t competing against one another, and there's younger students out there that have been brought here this year, so the next year when they move up into the next grade, they'll be ready to compete. Our children are our future, and, and the schools are struggling with the budget cuts and everything nowadays. It's just so hard that I believe industry needs to get involved. We need to get involved and help out. We can't just say, oh, you know, it's their problem, it's ours. And if we don't do this now, we're gonna lose everything that we have in our country and what we stand for and the great tech, you know, all the high technology that we have. If we don't focus on our children today, we're also building the workers of tomorrow. So, and like I said, we've gotten rave reviews. KEDC is really, really um, supportive. That's Current Economic Development Corporation. They want to, they see the need for this. And uh, others have too on how important it is and how we want to help. And we find that this program, as inexpensive as it is, it is so successful. And that's our dream. It's our goal to do that and see if we just can't make a change and help our kids and help our country. What we have here is in that audience is future engineers, future adventurers that are going to take this to the next step for our country. You know, we've been a, a nation of, of entrepreneurs, a nation of adventurers, and this will keep us from becoming just a consumer nation and a colony for some other nation that's doing this. These people are excited, they're thrilled, and in a few years you're going to see engineers coming out of that crowd. Think of the Intermediate Space Challenge as taken away. Um, the kids who are looking forward to the Space Challenge would be very disappointed. Um, the kids see every year it builds and it gets a little better. The competition gets a little more stiff. They like to compete with the teachers they've had before and the rivalries there and it's a lot of fun. Green River Bay Pride of winning this award, it really meant a lot. I learned that when you try your best, you may do, you may get something for a